After running an organic reaction, an extractive workup is commonly used to isolate and partially purify the desired product. A typical reaction is run in an organic solvent. To begin a typical workup procedure, water is added to the reaction mixture. Depending on the reaction, the added water might be acidic or basic. Water serves to stop certain reactions by quenching the reactive species, and it acts as a proton source as well. The added water helps to purify the product by dissolving any inorganic salts or ionic byproducts that might be present. Next, the product is extracted with an organic solvent such as ether. The organic product will prefer the organic solvent and will move to the organic layer. The aqueous layer is usually extracted two to three times with fresh portions of ether to maximize the extraction of the desired material. These organic layers are combined and the resulting organic layer is often washed with various aqueous solutions. For example, if the reaction was acid catalyzed, the reaction workup would probably contain a base wash to remove any remaining acid. An extraction step is one that pulls out a desired product. Otherwise, the product is described as washing if it removes something that will eventually be discarded. Finally, the organic layer must be dried before the solvent can be removed. An organic solvent such as ether will have a small amount of water dissolved in it after an extraction procedure. Such a solution is described as being wet and will often appear cloudy. To dry the solvent, the organic layer can be washed with a portion of saturated aqueous NaCl called brine. This will remove the remote majority of dissolved water and the remaining water can be removed by treatment with a solid drying agent such as calcium chloride, sodium sulfate, or magnesium sulfate. Once the organic solvent has been dried, it can be decanted or filtered from the drying agent and then evaporated, often under reduced pressure as with a rotary evaporator or rotovap, to leave behind the isolated product.